everyone! Welcome to my channel, Carolina's Creations Handmade. The perfect place for you to learn how to make beautiful things of your own. So make sure if you're not a subscriber, you click the red button down below. And also, please click the bell button down below so you don't miss any of my videos. And today I want to share with you a super amazing haul. This is going to be a haul for joints. Gina Marie Designs and Pink and Main. This is an online haul. I bought a lot of things for the 4th of July sales. And I also wanted to let you know I'm going to have a new section in my channel that is going to be called Swap With Me. This new series is going to be about happy mail swapping. And this is kind of crazy. It's been kind of crazy for a while, but I really never heard much about it. And now I've been kind of looking into it and it's so, so awesome. So I have new paws from New Zealand, Belgium and everywhere. So I'm going to be doing some Swap With Me and we're going to be swapping happy mail things that we create and these people are amazing so um a lot of them are here in the u.s and a lot of them are international so keep an eye for that because it's going to be really fun let me show you my haul so i'm going to start with the pink and main first and this one i was enabled once again by happy mail queen armin you always get me <laughs> she showed a few days ago a haul and she actually showed this dye from Pink and Main. And I so love it. I love the shape of it. So, of course, I had to go get it. Um, I think she showed the medium balls. But for me, this one was kind of like a little small. So, I also got the large one. And I'm going to show you so you can see the large one is really not that big. Let me show you here. So, this is the different types. I love the tails. They're so stinking cute. And I love that they're stitched. So this is the medium size, and as you can see, it's not all that big. So the smaller one is even smaller, so I really like the large size, and I like the smaller one for paper clips and uh, smaller embellishment. They're super adorable, the shape of the balls. I love them, and I love that they're stitched. So I got the two of them. This is the medium size, the large one, and they have the smaller size, but I think the smaller one would be kind of like too small for me right now. I may buy it later on. And... um. It's really nice. They packed it so cute. I bought it from the pink and main side. And look at how they package it. So adorable. And they also included this little stamp with my purchase, which I thought was super sweet because actually I didn't purchase much. I just purchased this too dice from them right now but I plan to go back because they have a lot of cuties there I bought some pink and maven from Joann's but I'm going to go back to their side look at this so cute I love this hibiscus on the leaf it says hi adorable and look at this how sweet here's a special treat from us to you enjoy pink and mane love it super nice from Joann's I got bunches of stamps they were doing their 4th of July sale, so I took advantage of that. They had super awesome prizes. I found these stamps from Prima for like, I don't know, less than $5 each or $5 each at the most. It was amazing. And look at this, girls. Oh my god. Prima Princesses. This one is Sydney. Isn't she just adorable? I mean, I can picture this on my projects already, and I love them. I love that I can color them, too. This is so nice. So this one is Stella. Love her, too. This one is Aubrey. Adorable. This one is Victoria. Look at that. So adorable. And this one's one of my, of my favorites. Grace. Oh, adorable. Look at Grace. I mean, I love them all. And look at this one. Olivia so 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 adorable these girls are adorable you have to uh keep in mind these are large stamps so if you don't like doing large stamps i don't recommend this to you but i'm going to use this for my larger projects like my outer composition notebooks and a lot of different projects and like altering my uh clipboards and things like that these are going to be awesome for them and for like bigger mini albums and things of the sort i just think these are such gorgeous stamps super super beautiful i mean amazing and um i've seen some of them before but i was always like i'm going to buy them i just bought so many other things that i had to leave them but this time i said i'm going to get them i love them i got this cacti stamp from fiskars it's super cute and i got it because actually i'm doing one of the projects with one of my swap partners for the happy mail and it's cacti so 
Yay! I'm going to be coloring and making a lot of embellishments with this. Adorable! Look at this. I love the, the little uh, cacti and all the little plants. It's so, so stinking adorable. I also bought these girls because I'm going to be doing fashion related projects. Coloring these girls for that. And look at this. The red stamps. Adorable. I love the girls with the selfie and all this. And then I bought this from Elizabeth Craft Designs. Super adorable. I love this black dress. I love this dress too. And I love all this for my fashion projects. Ah! Adorable. And I like that this one is clear. It's a clear stamp. So I really like that. This one is not clear. It's a red rubber stamp. But it's still really good. Actually, red rubber stamp is better quality. But I, I like the clear stamp better. <laughs> and look at this one. I've been eyeing this forever too. And I never bought it. But I just decided I'm going to get it. Because I, again, I want to make some projects. Fashion style. And I think this are super awesome. So this is Stampers Anonymous from Tim Holtz. Super, super nice. I love this. And I didn't tell you the names of this. So this one is Fashions 2. And this one is called City Girls Summer Vacation. I really like this quote stamp from Darkroom Door. It says, wake up each morning with the thought that something wonderful is about to happen. And I think this is amazing. So I bought it. I love it. I'm going to use it on my project. And then I bought some like food related stamps for candy projects and things like that. This one, this ones I thought they were going to be a little bigger, but it's okay because I can use them for backgrounds and for embellishments too. This is art stamp from Carabelle Studio from friends. These ones are uh, rubber. They're not clear, but they're nice. Love us. So I'm going to be using this for my sweet projects sweet related projects so i got this one this one is from chain doodles and all these that i've been showing you are from joanne the prices were crazy for the fourth of july sales so this is jane doodles you're sweet you're the coolest yum you melt my heart and i love the little um ice cream shapes they're adorable and there's are perfect for coloring so I love this. So I had to buy that one. Then I bought some more from Pink and Main, but this one's I got from Joanne's, not from the Pink and Main site. And this one's are summer related. This one is called Sis the Day. And it has this super cute octopus and the little dolphins and all these little uh, sea creatures and things. I love this. And then this is so cute. Look at these two girlies. So adorable and the little boy and look at the cute little sun and the flamingo, the flip-flops, the coconut, sunglasses and all that. I really love this too. I think it's super cute. This one is called Sending Waves. Yeah. So this one is from Photo Play and it's called For the Love of Summer. And I love that. I love the flamingos and I bought it mostly because I love this uh, swimsuit. I love the stripes. And I like this so and it was so inexpensive because of the sale so I had to get it and now I'm going to show you my haul from Gina Marie designs um, I got this from her website and they were super inexpensive I don't remember exactly the price but I think this ones are five dollars six dollars something like that and look at how cute the dice are from uh, Crafters Companion. I love the slipper, the slipper here. Super, super like it. So this is a glass slipper and it's super cute. I got this one here, the Tendelier. So I love it too. These ones are edgeable so you can make even like the toppers and uh, things like for the tables and a lot of different things so I really like this this one is called classic chandelier then I bought this one I so love this one this one is called Victoriana and I love the shape of it I love that you can use it in several different ways I love that and look at this look at this super huge 
amazing adorable chandelier I love this I'm gonna use it to make um, shakers and look at how adorable so love this one this one is called classic chandelier and um, I think this one was like eight nine dollars or maybe ten very inexpensive I mean not very inexpensive but very inexpensive compared to the regular price so this one is create a card look at how beautiful this is the gate adorable and this one is called grand entrance i so love that gate super super beautiful and all this kind of like go perfect with each other like this go perfect with this and this and then you have the glass slippers and the gate this is so so beautiful I bought this from David Tatera and this I bought also at Gina Marie Designs website. Um, I think it was like six dollars or so. They're huge and you can make them smaller and I love this because like I said I'm going to be doing a uh, project for one of my swaps that is cacti related and succulents and all that so I'm going to use this for that project too. And this was super inexpensive too at her website. And then look at this! Disney carriage. I love it. So stinking cute. Look at how it looks. Adorable. I couldn't leave this. It's a fairy tale carriage. And it's so adorable. And this one was super inexpensive there too. This one's I bought online. I didn't buy them at Gina Marie's. I've been buying this for uh, a couple of weeks now. So I didn't get this in one purchase. I get them in several different ones. So look at this. This is that witch's hat. And I bought it because Halloween is going to be coming soon. Please, not too soon. Time is flying. Too fast for me. So this one was $5, but I love the size of that. I think this would make really cute embellishments. And also, I'm going to try to make it into something different that I'm going to show you later. I bought this palm trees. I so, so love them. I like that it's embossed and cut. Then you have the little coconuts and the two palm trees. I don't think I've seen coconuts in all my other dyes for that. This is one of my favorites. Oh, I love this. This coconut and the hibiscus. Aloha. I think this is super cute, so I love that too. I love, I love this. This tatum pole is so super stinking cute and it's great for those projects too. But I got the girl. Of course, <laughs> the Hawaiian girl. I love this. Then I had I got this little paws, and I'm going to make them into um, magnetic paper clips. So I'm going to show them to you later. These are going to look stinking adorable. So I bought this. I bought this one too. This is this supposed to be like a whale tail? But it's actually looking more like a um, mermaid. And then you have the waves here, the water and stuff. So. I actually bought it because of the tail. I love it. And I already made a paper clip with it. And I think it turned out so super stinking adorable. I'm going to show you how I made it in one of my next videos. It's super easy. I bought this little sheep. I thought it was super stinking cute. Um, it's so inexpensive. I think it was like $5, $8. So, I mean, super inexpensive. And then I bought this before but I didn't have the circle one and this looks super cute I have the, all the other shapes the rectangle the square the oval but I didn't have this one and I so love this shape when it's die cut it's so beautiful and I also bought this one this is a loopy die and it's so stinky cute too so I didn't have this one so I bought the shapes for this the circle the square the oval and the, re the rectangle and I think these are 10 each it's really inexpensive if you consider you have a lot of different dyes here so these are great and your quality is really good for dyes cut really really nice this one is super cute it only coats the inside and then you have the whole uh, frame I purchased all the shapes in this and this was double stitching in and out so when you cut it you're going to get stitching on the piece on the negative and stitching on the positive so this is great so I bought the different shapes for that and again her prices are amazing her quality is really good 
And then I'm going to show you finally, here are the new Graphic 45 tags. They came out not too long ago and I purchased them because I love Graphic 45 tags. Um, I didn't think they were going to be this big, <laughs> but I love them anyways. I'm going to tell you though, I'm going to show you. This one over here, this is the shape it cut, the size, and it's the same width of this larger tag over here. Didn't know this too, we're going to be kind of like the same size, uh, the same width. So if I wouldn't known that, I probably wouldn't not gotten this one because you can actually cut this one to any size you want. So you can trim it to this size, you can leave it longer as it is. And this one I would have bought for sure because I really like this little size tag. The smaller tag is adorable. So, uh, and with this, it's great because you can make pockets with it. You can score it in the middle, fold it, and just add score tape on the sides, and then you have a pocket tag. So this is amazing. This is awesome. You have, actually, you, with this one, you could get just three sizes. Because you can cut this tag to this size, to the length of it. And then you can have the length, the longer length, you have the smaller one. So you don't need to buy this one if you don't really uh, care for this tie. And then you have here, this one is a wider one, it's super wide, and I love this little clock in here. And I love that they come with little dice also inside. I love these little flowers. I can make I can wait to make flowers with them. They look super cute. Graphic 45 is one of my favorites. And I super love this tiny one. So if you want to buy them, just <laughs> keep in mind that they're large. They're not smaller tags, but I love them. There's one thing I'm not very crazy about, and it's this hole. Because this is going to cut the hole. I like putting metal, um, how do you call those? I am so sorry I haven't slept much, so my brain is somewhere else. I cannot for the life of me remember how you call this. And I'm going to have to try to find something that fits in here, and that's going to be a little difficult, because I don't know how I'm going to be able to set it. I'm not sure if the crocodile sets a piece that wide, but I love it. I'm sorry this is going to be a little long, but I wanted to show it to you. So I hope you like my haul, and I hope you're having an awesome weekend. Thank you so much for all your love and support. I appreciate you guys so, so much, and I'm going to be having a giveaway soon because as soon as I get to 6,000 subscribers, we're going to be having a giveaway that uh, I had to postpone due to my husband getting sick. But I already have, as you know, the scan and cut that's going to be part of the giveaway. We're going to be doing the $100 um, gift certificate from an online store of the winners choosing. And that one is going to be so that internationals subscribers can participate too because they're not going to be able to participate for the scan and cut due to the size of it and shipping it would be crazy so thank you so so much guys i love you thank you to all my new subscribers welcome to my channel and i hope to see you guys here soon for another video bye bye love you guys Mwah.